You're gonna get my cream? Watch what, come in here, I dare you. I dare you. <gasps> hummingbird! Hi, hummingbird! You're like goddamn Snow White or something. All the birds and creatures are just drawn to me. Hi, I'm Montana Dana, and on today's episode of Girl vs. Van, we spend a beautiful morning at the Grand Canyon. I make friends with these flying beetles of death. I make friends with a hummingbird. I make friends with a lizard. And I make friends with whatever the hell that was. Subscribe for daily videos. I hear a wild animal. little peekaboo where we're at this morning. It's only 5 30 a.m. and I didn't really want to wake up but I really wanted to check out this view. See where we're at this morning. We're in a legit campsite. Oh yes. I didn't realize there was a fire pit. Good lord it's beautiful. We're gonna make some coffee. But I was at this really pretty overlook last night for sunset. We're gonna go there. get ready for the day. I'm gonna wash off the makeup I forgot to remove last night. Oh, we do have some friends over there. Okay, there's lots of people parked over here. I thought I was all alone out here last night. Hello. Maybe I can find someone to make out with tonight at sunset. That's all I need. Actually, I am gonna crawl back into bed just for a little bit. It's so cozy. Listen to the birds. Listen to all the nature. Snuggle up for a little bit. I'm not ready for morning coffee. I'm not ready to be alive. And morning coffee does not even sound good right now. Oh, this fresh mountain air sounds good though. Shit, that's fresh coffee. Brush your hair, Mac. Brush your hair. How many times do I have to tell him? to brush his hair in the morning. Um, I decided, as much as I'm loving this magical woodland paradise, I really wanna see some more Grand Canyon. So we're gonna go hang out at the Overlook. I have a really long video to edit this morning. I'm gonna do it with a little pretty scenery. Oh, mother. This is my pet peeve about this van. My key is right here, but my car never turns on. My key has been here the whole time. Silly safety features. To unlock the doors. Lock them back up, and then you can turn on your vehicle. Jesus, can't take him anywhere. I'm not staying here or doing a hike today because I have other adventures I want to do tonight. So I'm just gonna want to hang out the Grand Canyon this morning. Why are we so creaky and crackly? She lost the weight, Adele Jesus. It's pavement, guys. Hallelujah and amen. A whole new world. A new fantastic point of view. I'm starting to think I need a companion. <laughs> The coffee view this morning. Oh my god, so pretty. What the 
the heck is going on out there? Okay, there are so many bugs. Don't even think about it. Big ass bumblebee thing. Don't even think about it. They're mating. Jeez, get a room, guys. Get a room. There's lots of little bugs everywhere out here. I mean, we are in nature. I need to make some screens for my back and my side door. I have screen fabric. That's the project for another time. I'm digging the spot, but I like backed up into a bush just because I wanted the picture. So as to not completely disturb the ecosystem, we're going to pull away from the bush a little bit. There's plenty of room here. Just wanted to get a pretty picture from the back. Hashtag bad life. That. I've already found like six of these things. Is this a tick? Please tell me that's not a tick. I will be so annoyed if you are a tick. It seems like a, a wood bug. Go, dude. Get out of my van. I didn't kill him. I mean, that was nice of me. I'm going to take off for Page, Arizona later because there's a Starbucks there. And there's a bunch of adventuring around there that I want to do. Hello, bee friend. I don't even know what kind of insect that is, but... You feel free to stay out of my van. Thank you. Yeah, three things I'm gonna do before I leave. Make coffee, write in my journal, do like my little morning routine thing. I want to tidy up a little bit and edit my video. We're gonna do all those things with this view this morning. Sounds groovy. There are quite a few bugs out here right now. A lot of you are saying to put peppermint oil around the edges of my van, around the tires. Any openings? I don't have peppermint, but I'm gonna try eucalyptus. Just give a little splatter. Maybe it'll help keep some of the pests away. Way. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Ah, these little bugs. I think they're coming in through my skylight. These ones. Who are you? You are not invited. You got eucalyptus oil everywhere. Maybe I'll light my candle. That might deter them. But someone also said essential oils are flammable. So now there's essential oil everywhere. I wish I had like a citronella candle. I do not, but maybe this will make them go away. I don't mind bugs flying in here as long as they get the f out by bedtime. Okay. Hey yo. Hey yo. I doodle chop you. Yeah, you better stay out of my van, crazy bugs. What are those bugs anyways? They sound like bees, but I don't think they're bees. Holy shit. This doesn't even seem real right now. This is ridiculous. I'm not afraid of you. Yeah, I kind of am actually. Hey bro, crap in my style. <gasps> hummingbird. Hi, hummingbird. They're like goddamn Snow White or something. All the birds and creatures are just drawn to me. Did you guys see that little hummingbird though? It's so cute. I hope that was on camera. That was so cute. Cheers from my reused Starbucks cup from yesterday. I love you, hummingbird. Oh, come back home. No, not you. Nothing with a stinger, please. Can we please have nothing with a stinger? I like to consider myself a pretty forward thinking, progressive person, like love is love and all those other hashtags. And I feel bad admitting this, but I think I'm in sexist. What the fuck was that bug? I did not like it. I did not like it at all. Where's my hummingbird friend? Hummingbird, where are you my friend? No, not fly. Does fly sound like hummingbird? No, it does not. These little bee things though are way too interested. Get a room, Jerry. Get a room. What? Is Cynthia not interested anymore because you're too aggressive? Yeah, don't be so aggressive, Jerry. Jesus Christ. Okay, I see you. You're my friend. Okay, Jerry, we can be friends. Just don't be so damn aggressive with the females. Freaking Jerry, man. Oh. Hi, Lizzie. Jerry, leave me alone. Gosh, take a hint, Jerry. I haven't called you back in four days. That's your hint, Jerry. I wish my hummingbird friend would come back. Well, I'm gonna enjoy my coffee with this view. We'll see if Jerry can keep his dick in his pants for a little bit so I can edit my damn video. I may have to go park at a different location because there's lots of bugs right here. I mean, we're in the wild obviously, but this spot specifically has a bunch of trees. These little tiny bugs are just getting everywhere. I don't really mind bugs. I just don't want like skeeters, you know, or anything with stingers bugs with stingers. I've been skipping out on my journal writing a little bit the last couple of days. I don't know, I've just been kind of out of the routine, I think. Jerry is so 
creaking forward. But I'm feeling really inspired right now to write. How can you not? How can you not be inspired? Let all the bugs come in my van. I don't even care right now. It's, it's just gonna happen. It's just part of it. I'm writing my journal, putting on my makeup. I'm just chill here for a while. Does Jerry have a stinger? Is he just happy to see me? Jerry is quickly becoming a Gerald. Gerald, go to your room. You're grounded. What are these bugs? Please tell me you're not a tick, right? You're not a tick. They're just a friendly little forest creature. Tomorrow may be a laundry slash vacuum every square inch of my van sort of day. I'm in love with this lifestyle right now. As much as a hot mess as I am most of the time. This is goddamn magical. Just removing my makeup from yesterday. Gary? I expected it to be like super blazing hot already. It's gonna get into the hundreds today, but it's 7.40 in the morning. It feels like 70s. Cools off quite a bit at night here, like it was like in the 40s last night. Oh, I see the lizard again. Hi, friend. Are you missing your tail? Oh, there's two of them. Lizard friends. There's three of them. They're kind of blending in. Do you see them? Jeez, Jerry, you're kind of a pimp. Got a little threesome happening over here. I mean, it's not my thing, but whatever you're into. Get it. Get it. I got a pretty bird in the tree. Pretty bird. Pretty bird. I am loving this. Ooh, as long as they're not going to hurt me. This is so cool. There's like lizards birds, little bug orgies, what's not to love? The cool thing about these landscapes is they change based on the sun because there's so much detail in these mountains. You look away for a minute and you look back up and it looks like a new backdrop almost. This is where I took my sunset pictures last night and it almost looks like a different place to me. I don't know. Jesus Christ, Jerry, if you try and fly in my van one more time, you are going to end up on my neighborhood watch list. Just you wait, Jerry. Just you wait. I don't know why I'm not afraid of this thing. They're like giant loud bees. I hate bees. Oh, look at this little lizard. Oh, he's trying to impress me. Yeah, do those push-ups. You cute. You cute. A little close for comfort, Gerald. I see you. Jerry, get. Get out of here. Jerry just came in the van. Jerry doesn't know what's in store for him. You, you. I have a macrame. Plant holder, Jerry. I'm not afraid to use it. I'm trying to get these Jerry's. These Jerry's be fucking. Every time he comes by, he comes a little closer to the van and finally came in here. Mm -mm -mm. Lizzie, what you want? You coming to say hello? Oh, wow. I dare you, Jerry. I triple dog dare you. Got a lot of nerve, Jerry. Got a lot of nerve. That's it. You're on my neighborhood watch list, Gerald. Trying to get my cream? Watch what, come in here. I dare you. I dare you. <laughs> I'm just going to take that as we now trust each other. I'm part of the ecosystem. Jerry is comfortable around me. So it's a pretty special relationship. Gerald, I hear you. I hear you down there. Oh my god, it's one of those bugs. Those tick things. I have to see if these are ticks or not. When I get into service, I'm gonna take a look. Please don't be ticks. There were like nine of you in my van earlier. Ready for the day. Coffee, makeup, journal writing. Check, check, check. I am gonna edit here at the Grand Canyon. We're gonna go to an actual overlook, mainly because they have restrooms there. It's been fun. Bye, Jerry. Bye, friends. Oh, he came to say goodbye to me. I know, I'm gonna miss you too, Jerry. I feel like we had a good thing going. Struggles of van life. It is just so hard to keep relationships going on the road, but call me. I need a husband. Okay, let's go. These bugs just really wanna come with me today. There's two of them. Look, it's the Mista Mista lady. Get me out of here. Hi, friend. Spread your wings and fly, baby, fly. I'll bet you they're all on top of my van from last night, and they're just like crawling through my skylight. Be free, I love you too, but go, fly away. I mean, we're going 50 and she hanging on. Do what you gotta do, Tina. How you doing, Tina, you good? You still hanging on? Okay. Guess Tina's coming with us. You want to go to Horseshoe Bend? We're going to go to Page, Arizona, like I mentioned earlier. And then we're going to head over to the Vermilion Cliffs. And if I finish my vlog in time, we're going to go to a super secret spot for sunset. Oh, 
here we are baby i don't know let's see it's loading this is what a tick looks like i think we're good doesn't a tick have like a red dot on its belly too i don't know no black widow spider has the red dot on the belly i don't know all i know is tina's gone I'm really sad about it <gasps> So many bugs in her. Jesus Christ. Check back tomorrow for part two of this video where we risk it all for the gram. And the weather and the lack of internet changes all of our plans. If you made it this far in the video, write Jerry down in the comments. And if you want to guess where I ended up this evening, write that down in the comments too. I've got a $10 Starbucks gift card going out to one of y'all if you guess right. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, share it with your friends. See you tomorrow.